Right, oh, it's Kev again. Uh, I'm just going to show you how to import another project into another project, if that makes sense. So, what we'll do is we'll bring let's bring a CD case in that I've done the other day. So, I made a CD case. You know, just made it myself, put my own pictures in, etc. I say I wanted to import this into another project, right? You think, well, how do you do it? Well, because once you go up here, File, Open Project, it wants to close this one. So what you do is, this is your composition. Click on your comp. We'll rename this CD. Rename that one CD case. Okay. So we go up to File and we shall go to Collect Files. This project needs to be saved first. Yeah, that's because I've done it. Right. Make sure it's on for selected comps. Reduce Project and there it'll tell you how many files are going to be collected for, for the project. So we press collect and we'll call this one Tim OCD case. So that's his name. Right, Tim OCD case. Right, that's the project saved. So now we'll close this project. Now let's open another project. Open recent projects then. We'll do the DVD case that I've done also. So here we have a DVD case that I made and so I want to put the CD case in as well. So what we do is we go to import, file and where did I put Tim, ah, Timo CD case, here it is. And we just click on that After Effects project there, open that and we just bring in what did I call it? CD case, didn't I? Just bring that in. Obviously we've got to open that because that's got a picture on. So we get rid of that. Get rid of that. Go back to comp one. And there we go. Is the CD case coming in? So what we do is obviously I've not learned that up, but that's how you get a, another project into another project. Obviously I built a DVD case and say I wanted to use this CD case as well. I don't have to do it all in one go. So that's how you import one project into another. So that's it guys. Fun, I hope that's answered a few questions on how to do it.